lined up giving out awards, so I want to go. GT350. Is this one going to win one? I hope so. I don't know. Hang on. Hang They're lined up here. Okay. We're at Lime Rock Race Park. We got mugs. And we got Ford Mustang. And the Mustang killed the Corvair. And for good reason, because it was a great car. GT350. Four speed on the floor. Signed by Carol Shelby. Disc brakes, real seat belts. Mustang GT350. 289, 271, romping, stomping, solid lifter, clackety clack horsepower. White with blue, blue with white. Torque thrust mags. Beautiful. We're in Lime Rock. We got rubber on the road. From those cars that just can't get a lot of power to the pavement. <laughs> Carroll Shelby Motors. Ford's finest turned into Carroll Shelby's performance engineered Shelby Mustangs. Cobra power. And if you want to see them, they're going to be in Balls to the Spa, New York, September 20th. Just off the Northway, I-87, exit 12. It's a Mustang cruising. And you want to see your Shelbys and your Ford GTs? Maybe a GT40 will show up. Or a GT500. Or even a crazy Chrysler 300G. Or maybe not. 67 Ford Mustang Shelby. Big block powered. Signed by the man, Carroll Shelby. He built the Fords. John Fitch built the racetrack where they race at. Cobra. 67 GT350 with a Paxton supercharger. Inject that power under pressure. GT350. Built to lay rubber on the racetrack at Lime Rock. We got the judges, the officials are well dressed. Wow. Brittany Blue Bullet. GT500. Big block power. Shelby. Rumble, rumble. Someone's going to win an award. <laughs> we don't know who it is. Keep it under wraps. What a beautiful GT500. Four speed. Wood wheel, rally pack, green line, Stuart Warner gauges. Is this baby rumble? Can you fire it up? Oh, I can't. My husband's got it. Oh, 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 don't I'm touch. Good. All we can do is look in the mirror. <laughs> well trained and respecting her better half's pride and joy. Don't slam that door. <laughs> Supercharged. GT350, under pressure. Got some more Fords here. Not the biggest fan of Ford, but I know when I like something and I like the Ford Mustang. Lean machine. Ford, 429, four barrel. High performance tow car, like that Torino that I saw. Very, Muscle Palooza. There, there was one at Muscle Palooza, Lebanon Valley, a Cobra Jet Shaker Hood station wagon. Yeah, huh? I got it on YouTube. Wow. Get out High of performance. What are you doing? Love those wheels. What do you think, Muggs? It's same color as Mr. Muggs. Come on. High performance station wagon. What a tow vehicle. LTD. Land yacht. You could land an airplane on the hood. They're so big. Back when American machines meant something. Four twenty-nine. Cougar XR7. Ford Fairlane 500. High performance Fords. Big exhaust pipe. Big tube. Four speed, beautiful interior. Cold air induction, big block. 
cold air in there. High performance exhaust out the back. Doing all right, Mugs? A little hot here in Lime Rock. Galaxy 500, barely in 500. Sunbeam Tiger V8. 260? 221, maybe. No, I don't think so. 260 or a 289? Tiger. Powered by Ford. Full body off restoration of a 67 Sunbeam Tiger. Roots Group. What a beautiful 100 point Concours restoration. Oh, razor laser straight. Gleaming. And V8 powered by Ford. Widowmaker. Cool. National Hot Rod Association. Street Rod. 1932. Wow, what a machine. V8. Nineteen thirty-two four with the big Buick drums. Keep some cool mugs. Sunbeam Tiger. Small block Chevy powered, suicide doors, thirty-two Ford. And you knew those were Buick brakes. Well, if you look carefully, it may even be hidden in the inside with discs. You're almost... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We're both wrong, though. Yeah. Those very well could be disc brakes. Could be a caliper hiding inside there. Yeah, you know, look in the Hot Rod magazine. they got all kinds of tricks now. Yeah. Disc brakes hidden inside Buick brake drums. Those may be them. Because the, if you look carefully, the brake hose, the high-pressure hose, yeah, is not bolted to the backing uh, plate. Caliper outlining. Look in that. Uh-huh. Yep, there it is. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> Pulls the so First <laughs> aluminum axle I've seen. Uh, no, I don't think so. I don't know if I trust aluminum. Pete and Jake's. Right there. Some guys weld a camshaft across the stretcher on the front of the frame. Just to be unique. Cool. Well, crank up this, Shelby. Rumble Rumble, 428 Cobra Jet, KR, King of the Road, and I believe it. Oh boy, 428 Cobra Jet, King of the Road. You love your Mustangs, you came to the right place at Lime Rock Race Park. Boss 302, built for racing. Red. Oh, it's bright orange 302 shaker hood, 70 Boss 302, matching motor, original build sheet, window sticker, Marty Report, 39,900, 40,000 bucks. You could have this beautiful 70 Boss 302. I think this is a coral color, maybe Calypso coral, maybe? Hmm, don't know my Ford colors too well, but it's a beauty. Lime Rock Race Park. Love our Fords. See ya. Thanks for looking.